that each soccer position has its own specific number assigned to it. I played soccer my whole life and honestly I didn't even know that for the longest time. But in this video I'm going to show you each position and the specific number assigned to it. to show you the numbers assigned to each specific position and the reason you would want to know that is maybe you're watching football on TV and they're referring to different players different positions as numbers and not just mentioning the position maybe you're watching an analyst speak about football so it's going to help you understand that as well also maybe your coach is giving tactical advice he's talking about soccer tactics football tactics and he's not referring to the positions he's just referring to the numbers so I'm going to give you a few different formations, but the numbers of the positions are the same. The formation may shift a bit, but the positions stay the same. So it would go like this. The goalkeeper is number one. Right fullback, number two. Left fullback, number three. Left center back, number four. Right center back, number five. And for these formations, I'm just going to keep a back four, but we'll do a couple different ones. One, two, three, four, five. Going into the midfield, six, eight, ten. The attacking midfielder is a ten. Defensive midfielder is a six. The eight may go forward and join the ten. He may stay here with the six. But specifically, attacking midfielder is a ten. Defensive midfielder is a six. The wingers, seven, eleven. Hey, what's up? I hope you're finding this content helpful. Watch this all the way to the end if you want to find out which subscriber got this video's special shout out. 11 and the striker is always number nine. The big goal scorer up top, he is number nine. So let's just do a slight variation. We're playing in a 4-2-3-1 right now. If we went 4-3-3, it stays the same. Okay, one, two, three, four, five. 6, 8, 10, 7, 11, 9. Sometimes the 8 may go and join the 10 and you might play with one defensive midfielder. He would be the 6. This would be a 10 and an 8 in here. And 7, 11, 9. You could play a 4-1, four, 4-1 one, four, one with one defensive midfielder. And it would be the same a six, an eight and a 10 in here, seven, 11, and the nine up top. Let's look at a traditional four, four, two. So the same from the back, one, two, three, four, five. Up top is the nine and the 11 would join him. Nine and 11 traditionally have been the two strikers because in the nineties, eighties, it was a lot of 4 4 2. 9 and 11 were usually up top. This would be a 6 and a 10 in here. 7, 8, 9, 11. So that's basically the different positions assigned to different numbers. So, as I said, it's going to help you if anyone ever mentions maybe you're watching um, professional football on TV and the analyst or the commentator keeps mentioning the number six, so he's such a good number six, or the attacking number 10, he's so good on the ball, he's so creative. The big number nine up top, this is gonna give you a better idea of those positions so you're not confused if you ever hear those terms. And also, like I said, if I'm playing uh, football, there's 11 players on the pitch, so that's why there's only 11 numbers here. Now, obviously, you can wear whatever number you want, and nowadays, players are getting higher and higher with their numbers, more ridiculous numbers, and it's all good. Wear whatever number you want, but if you play right fullback, maybe you want to select that number two. If you play left fullback, three. Center backs, four and five. Midfielder, especially that defensive midfielder, six. The attacking midfielder, you're the number 10. The wingers are seven and 11, usually, if you're playing with two wingers, or if you're in a, if you're in that four, four, two, it would be that seven and that eight. But up top, if you want to be the big goal scorer, wear the number nine. 11 is a cool number as well. 
And at the end of the day, you can wear whatever number you want, but I hope you found this video helpful. If you were looking for soccer positions with specific numbers, if you did, please like, comment, share this video, subscribe to Progressive Soccer, and I'll see you in the next video. This is the featured subscriber for this video. If you'd like to be featured in future videos, hit that like button, drop a comment below, and let me know how my videos have helped you improve and achieve more in this sport.